What's up guys and welcome back to the Real Guns of Battlefield 4. Today's gun is the SAR-21. The SAR-21 is a gas-operated rotating bolt weapon designed in 1996 by Tukwa Chi and Felix Tsai at CIS. In game, the damage values are very typical at 18 to 25 with the standard assault rifle drop-off of 8 to 55 meters. The muzzle velocity is 650 meters per second. The fire rate is 600 rounds per minute. The bullet drop is standard for assault rifles at 15 meters per second squared. The cartridge is the standard 556 NATO. And the mag size is 30 plus 1. You'll be seeing the recoil pattern on your screen right now. It is a very stable recoil pattern, with most of the recoil being sideways wobble. The reload times on this weapon are 2.3 seconds with a bullet in the chamber, and 3.4 seconds when empty. In real life, this weapon has an 805mm barrel, an effective range of 460 meters, a muzzle velocity of 970 meters per second. The rate of fire of the SAR-21 in real life varies between 450 and 650 rounds per minute. The cartridge in real life is in fact 556 NATO, and this weapon is capable of accepting the standard 30 round box, or the Draft Stanag standard magazine. The name SAR-21 stands for Singaporean Assault Rifle 21st Century. The SAR-21 was designed to replace the aging M16 stock in the Singaporean military, and was designed to be lighter and lower maintenance than said weapon. Early models of the weapon had some issues. The difference in the location of the magazine well made it difficult for the operators who had been trained on the M16 to adjust. The fire selector was located closer to the action than the operator's hands. Left-handed soldiers were forced to operate the weapon right-handed, and this is still the case to this day. The iron sights on the early models of the weapon were easily chipped if the weapon was dropped, and the scope on the weapon was not internally illuminated, making it difficult to use the weapon in the dark. This weapon is also used by Brunei, the Indonesian Special Forces and Air Force, Morocco, the Peruvian Special Forces, and Thailand. Due to the newness of the weapon, there is not much more information available. Realism-wise, the range on this weapon has an 88% difference. The muzzle velocity has a 33% difference. The rate of fire is completely within the realm of possibility. The bullet drop difference is standard for assault rifles at 53% different. And the magazine size is identical to the physical weapon. Overall, this puts the weapon at roughly 35% different from the actual weapon. That'll have to be it for this time, but if you enjoyed, I encourage you to like, favorite, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.